Hey, girl. Hey, so let me get you caught up on all the drama that's been taking place with Blueface and Krishan over the past few weeks. So we all know that Carlissa Blueface mama had released a little video of her kissing a belly and an ultrasound. We was like, mm-hmm. That ain't Krishan. Then Krishan come on with an ultrasound video of her at the doctor even having the heartbeat on video, y'all. And then it was this cringe part of the video where the mama was touching her stomach and everybody was like, uh-uh, what's going on? Why she acting like that to her mama? And then Blueface and her start arguing. I mean, that was arguing, girl. Then she released this long dissertation about, like, being a single mom and Blue not being there. And he, like... I don't want to hear no stop, sob story. You know what time it was when you clocked in. And child, once he did that, I mean, they went to back and forth and forth and back and forth and back. It took me a while to just keep up with him. And then before you know it, boom. Krishan came to her senses. She like, oh, hold on. The math ain't matching. And Blueface like, what? What you mean? She like, he been playing in my face. And he been playing in my face for a long time. Like, no, I ain't going for that. I need my money. Pull up with my money. Run me my money. Girl, she started counting the money, how much money she had, trying to get her piggy bank out. And then Blueface gonna say, Go draw her. I made one dollar of Krishan. I'm eating off Krishan. Krishan pays me, feeds me. That is the falsest narrative I've ever heard. Child, and we was all like, huh? What you mean? You were what? So where the money at? Child, he trying to make it seem like she had spent the money that she had made and like what? Like you keeping a tab, a tally? Child, then he even sent this whole little thing about how he was giving her money like a little cash app Zelle receipt from 2020. And you know how when somebody playing with your money, you start coming to your senses real quick. Stuff start making sense. You start understanding. That's what she start doing, y'all. I'm settling, bro. Destroying each other, yo. Like, I swear to God. Think about it, nigga. I fucking hate this nigga, yo. This shit is crazy, bro. Child, she said, nigga, my nigga, I hate this nigga. Bars. Oh, she was so deep in her feelings that she was drowning in her emotions. Video linked in the comments. So she also let us know what the deal was at that appointment and also why it was so cringy. Girl, she spilled all the tea right here. We got down to the nitty gritty if I'm having an abortion or not. Because I was going to do it because how he was just so, like, he was so ugh. I ain't going to nigga just, like, I'm not finna have your kid if you want to kill me. So, but we planned it this time, so it's different. Girl, yes, you heard her right. They planned it. She even released some text messages where he talking about he gonna be a good daddy to their baby. So even though the whole time he was denying it to us, he behind the scenes, uh, sweet talking her. The whole time, we think she just been delusional and weird. Cause why, why you being weird to me? So after she see how wishy-washy he was being, she like, okay, well, I'm going to just go ahead on and go to the clinic. Child with the cameras and the dog. Girl, yes, they had the dog at the deletus to feed appointment. So we get to that damn clinic, and that's why I was so uncomfortable. Like, I didn't want my mother touching me or none of that. Like, I'm ready to kill this baby. I'm, I'm ready to kill this baby. I made up my motherfucking mind, right? So, okay. I made up my mind, and then when I got there, I seen the heartbeat, the face. I just trembled, like I just fell, like my. I, I that's what I just. Oh uh, shit! That thing is not. It's a. It's a person there, like. So I'm like, I can't get you what you want. I'm so sorry. Like it's not gonna work. But I'm still indecisive. So I don't know. I don't know. Lord Jesus, you know what I'm saying? So I decided whatever, whatever. So after five months, this man is still pressuring this girl to delete his defeatus. And y'all, we all know she was not getting rid of that baby. Come on now. If you ain't keeping the baby, that stuff get done ASAP Rocky. You don't waste no time. And nine times out of ten, you know before you pregnant if you should be keeping a dude baby or not. And what dimension is she living in that time is going so slow for her? When I see my stomach, I'm like, oh, it must be like two months. You feel me? I'm, like, I'm five. I'm five months. No. Like, what? No. What are you saying? Like, for real, bro. 
Girl, I guess she been so booked and busy with these hostings that she done lost track of time. Mind you, she already geared up to do Baddies East. The bitch is so dumb. She said, the baby's not going to stop me from going on the road and getting money and hustling and doing what I need to do. I said, who going to watch the baby while you on the road hustling? She said, I'm going to have an on the road nanny. I'm not telling the bitch to get an abortion for me. I'm telling her to get an abortion for her. Oh, for her. He's so thoughtful, isn't he? Because he already letting us know that he ain't doing nothing for the baby. He was over to uh, Jaden's house while she in the background giggling, talking about how he don't watch the kids. Child, Jaden, that's not the flex that you think it is, mama, that your baby daddy ain't watched the kids for more than 24 hours. He was really trying to set Krishan off, and that's just what he did because she went over there and set his stuff on fire child i'm surprised his smoke detectors work as much as they be beeping <laughs> what is wrong with you kid that's what you gonna do with a newborn baby on the way set the house on fire this bitch is dumb Look how dumb the bitch is. Child, she walked by like it was a scary movie. I mean, this girl was not playing. He brought them emotions out, and she brought the fire out. Ooh, this is a lot. And she about to have a kid? Bitch, a kid herself. You leave her too by herself too long, she just start fucking shit up. Bitch, like a, a, a six-year-old. You leave a six-year-old by, by yourself, you gonna come home, your shit gonna be cut up, burnt up, broken up. Door gonna be broken. The bitch tried to turn the smoke detector off. <laughs> the bitch hopped on the table to turn the smoke detector off. Man, child protective custody gonna have a ball with you. I must say, you making this very too much easily. And child support gonna have a bigger ball with you. Cause I don't know what make you think she ain't gonna get that money once things start drying up between y'all two. Somebody, whether her friend or her family, gonna tell her to get you. Because once it's a vibe, ain't vibing no more. Oh, she gonna try to stick it to you where it hurts. In your pockets. The bitch unplugged the Wi-Fi thinking the smoke detector was gonna turn off. Oh my god. Girl, then before you know it. He over there cupcaking with the kids, and why she pop up eating crab with Black China? Child, yes. <laughs> See, trying to show them guess what? It's, it's Black China's birthday. <laughs> girl, yes. So she started living her best life. Let's get into it. Happy birthday, girl. What? Uh, yeah. Happy birthday, girl. Happy birthday, girl. Happy birthday, girl. Happy birthday, girl. Now, you know he wanted her to be somewhere sad, but she wasn't doing that. She was out with the homegirl screaming, ah, turning up, twerking. So they was out in D.C. filming for Baddies East auditions. And, child, she was loving it. She was getting her room service on. Child, she even had one of her homegirls out there putting in work for her for one of Blueface's alleged little uh, side piece cuzzo. She was in his little group home, uh, Blue Girls Club. Yeah, her. So everything was all good until Krishan got to the bathtub. And it's like when she got in the bathtub, her senses went down the drain with the water or something because she started talking about she want to have 12 kids. She don't. She wanted to have twins. And how she want to get Blue name. Uh, she want to get his face make it 3d and get it filled in like she was basically having plans on revamping the blue face tattoos it's like girl we're not considering getting them removed she like it's gonna leave scars basically she was saying a whole bunch of she ain't ready to leave this ninja now we already know that her homegirl's gonna be the one watching this baby but 12 kids you're smoking dick <laughs> child so while she turning up in dc getting hands put on folks 
he out here chain smoking with her money, child. He used a 50 to light his blunt. Like, child, come on now, Blue. You're doing too much, honey. You're trying too hard to show that you don't care. So Mother's Day roll around and Blueface want to go so hard for his baby mama all of a sudden. Talking about her BBL. Talking about how solid she is. Showing a tattoo on her butt. Child, we know you've been playing in her face for the longest. So stop trying to act like you own her team so heavy. Child, we already know she part of the clown show. She the original dummy. So for Mother's Day, he tried to hurt Christian, and his trifling butt didn't even wish his own mama a happy Mother's Day. Ooh, he's so trifling. So happy Mother's Day, Carlissa. And ladies, if you have a man that don't get along with his mama or his sister, child, that's a huge red flag. And if he don't get along with his granny, girl, run, because you know niggas love their granny. Girl, so I got you all caught up. So if anything happened, I'm going to be the first to let you know. And we got to talk about Rhodey because, y'all, she getting lipo. Y'all know they had the baddies reunion, so we're going to talk about that. And I got some tea on an alleged side main chick that Blue supposedly had. Yes, girl, so we're going to get in that too. So I'm going to hit you later, okay? Oh, and all the videos that I mentioned, they're going to be linked in the comments. All right, y'all, until next time. Bye. Make a psycho, make a traffic psycho.